I've forgotten how beautiful the view is up here. Oh, I uh, see you found your kite. Well, you promised to take care of it for me. And I did. So I'm looking for someone. Since when have we had a business relationship? You know I get caught even touching a computer. My ass goes away for 20. <laughs> Name your price. You know I'm good for it. You know, information like this doesn't have a price. Ainsley, everything has a price. Now, if you don't think you can pull it off, if you lost your edge, just tell me and I'll understand. You want to know what it is, Cage? What? I used to think you were the man. But now, I don't know, maybe I feel like you're just working for him. Come on. Nobody knows I'm here. And you know how I am about keeping secrets. Well, so you say, but Interpol's got these new listening bugs. I mean, they're practically invisible. Real MI6 kind of shit. Disappear in your skin, under your arms, tied around your balls like a Christmas bow. Wrap me then. You know, studies have proven that sexual consummation irrevocably ruins nine out of 10 relationships. Lucky for me. You love to gamble. Oh, of course. Not. My friends, on the other hand, adore stiff odds. Stiff odds? Things I do for my country. Like finding needles in a stack of needles. Even when you're shackled by the queen, you're still the best in the world. Thank you. Mm. Do yourself a favor. Burn this. The whispers I hear, these ghosts of yours, are the real kind of trouble. And you got training, they got funding, and you got no problem running over anyone who gets in their way. Okay, so you're worried that I might get hurt? I'm worried you might get dead. You know, I'm touched that you can imagine a world without me in it. It'll be a little less fun. That's all I'm saying. Your ghosts are hanging out in the Philippines. Figures they go to the Pacific. Some jungle rave that's off the grid. How the hell did you find it so quickly? Undercover work. Hey, do you want to ride, ride, ride in my fall? In my fall. Do you turn up, baby? Oh, we ain't got no place to go. Where is it? What did you do with Pandora's box? It's in a safe place. That wasn't a part of the plan. After all these years, you're still shocked when I improvise. No, but the mission was to destroy it. Turns out there's a new mission. I'm not going to destroy the one thing I can use to get what we want. The whole world is looking for us, Zhang. Let them come. You worry about pawn sacrifice? I got my eye on the king. That's the problem. 
You forgot the queen. After your success taking down Anarchy 99, Gibbons was handed a blank check. Which is the long way of saying he got you a new ride. World went and got an upgrade since you died, Cage. Onboard drones, anti-air countermeasures, and fuel tanks big enough to circumnavigate the globe three times without ever landing. You can check your code. I promise you, no one would dare steal it. Can't guarantee it won't walk off on its own. Wheels up in ten, boys, which means you're already seven minutes behind. Is she always this much fun or just on special occasions? No wonder our country's in debt trillions of dollars. Do you really need all these gadgets to get the bad guys? Oh, we don't need any of it. But it makes the catching a hell of a lot more fun. Hmm. Xander Cage. Holy shit. Live and in concert, one night only. This is crazy. I was at Coachella and Guns N' Roses got back together, but this is way cooler. Well, I I, w I wasn't actually there, but I like heard about it. You know, I'm still talking. Oh my god, I'm so I'm sorry. It's like a, it's a bad habit. I, I get started and then I can't stop and then I can't. Breathe. <sighs> Take your time. I know mouth to mouth if necessary. <laughs> wow. Wow. Are you kidding me with those guns? You're like the freaking Terminator. And I'm not talking about the first Terminator, but the second Terminator that goes back to kill the first Terminator. He was the liquidy metal guy. Agent Clearage worked closely with Gibbons. She'll handle support for the operation. And I bet a guy like you needs a lot of support. What are you, like 220, 230? Be honest, 250 is like the hard max for my swing. <laughs> oh, come on. I'm kidding. It's not like I have a safe word or anything. It's kumquat. Never really think about it. Kumquat. What about you? <laughs> Not safer than in my vocabulary. Touche, you are Xander Cage. <laughs> Anything you need, Becky can source it within the hour. Except for any sort of illegal drugs. Those I'll have within 15 minutes. <laughs> Kidding. <laughs> if you need a 50 of purple Urkel, I am not the girl to ask. Okay, Cage, follow me. I'll introduce you to your ground team. Thank you, Becky. Of course. Come quiet. Hey, here comes the Red Bull Freak Show. <laughs> Xander Cage, I want you to meet Paul Don Donovan. Captain Paul Donovan. I know you. I saw you on TV. The president gave him a medal. That must have been pretty cool, right? You guys must have some seriously cool stories to tell. Must have seen a lot. Wonder. How many of you have ever pulled a freestyle triple backflip on a BMX bike before, all of you? No, we don't play on bikes. Oh, you don't play on bikes? Any of you ever uh, carve an R4 on a snowboard while an avalanche is on your booty? We're soldiers, hotshot, not slackers. Okay, but you all have halo jumped over Eastern Europe using a standard issue armored deployment parachute system. Am I right? Nope. We're not all jacked up on Mountain Dew and Red Bull, you asshole. <laughs> Where'd you find this guy? Well, this is the first time for everything. What did you just do? I can't believe this shit. I'm not gonna have clowns watch my back. I know I'm gonna regret asking you this, but who would you trust? 